Hey everybody, this is Jats Alex, and today I'll be showing you how to mod Fallout New Vegas. So the first thing you're going to want to do is sign into your account, and then you're going to want to plug in your USB thumb drive that you'll be using in this tutorial, or mod, or whatever. And you're going to go over to System Settings, you're going to go to Memory, you're going to go to your hard drive, you're going to go to Games, you're going to click on Fallout, and then if you have multiple saves, you'll get a list. Um, probably the last auto save or something is the one you're going to want to use you're going to click A, you're going to click move and you're going to move it to your USB if you've never used this USB before it'll ask to format it you're going to want to go ahead and format it but warning it will, when it formats it that's just deleting everything on there and making it Xbox compatible so make sure anything that's important, important on the USB to get it off first all right, so now that it's on the the game save is on the USB, we're gonna go ahead and switch over to the X or the PC. Hey everybody! Now that we're on the computer, you're gonna wanna go ahead and plug in your USB. I just did so, and you might get a little um, little bit of stuff that pops up. You can just exit that out. And you're gonna need two programs. You're gonna need Modio, and you're gonna need Fallout NVVA Beta 2.5 or whatever version it's on when you watch this. All the download links in the underbar, so you can just go ahead and download those while you're watching or whatever. So the first thing you're gonna to want to do is open up Modio. You're gonna give this a second to load. Sometimes Mario takes a minute to load up. All right. Now you're gonna go up to the big M. You're gonna click Explore My Devices. You're gonna click File, Open, Close, and give it a second. And your USB should be detected. There it is. All right. And now you're gonna. You you should probably only have one profile on here. So uh, you're gonna open up that profile. Nope, that's not the profile. Here it is. Um, and when you open up the profile, you'll see Fallout New Vegas. You'll open that up, and you'll hit Game Saves, and you'll see this. It should have that same thing you named. Uh, it was named before. And you're going to click it, and you're just going to drag and drop it to the desktop. And you can minimize this. You don't have to close that out quite yet. And you should have this on your desktop. So if you're having problems dragging and dropping, you can actually right-click and hit um, right click on it and hit extract and you can extract it to the desktop if that works a little easier alright so the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open up the fallout editor it's a pretty simple editor alright and then once this is open you're going to hit file open and you're going to go to your desktop and you're going to open up that new save Um, no, and then this all the stuff will pop up, and that is my phone. Great, I'll be right. All right, sorry about that. I turned my phone off now. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead, and you can pretty much edit anything you want. Um, I mean, you can. There are a couple limits. Let's see what those limits are for your. For your weight, hmm. let's see. For all of these down here, all the specials is ten. You can just click max specials and it'll put everything at ten. All right, and then the max you can make your weight is um, negative two. For um, your action points, you can make it one hundred and forty-seven at max. For this, you can make it 483 at max. For your HP, you can make 191. And I'm not sure about the others. Um, if I find out more, I will put a big thing in the middle of the screen so you guys can know. And then over to your skills, you can hit max skills. That'll put everything at 100. That's high as you can go. 
And then for your inventory, if you find codes and stuff for guns, you can um, add in um, all your um, you can add in guns and stuff. I'll make a tutorial on that later on if I get to it. Hopefully I will. And then you're gonna click. What are you gonna click? You're gonna click. Um, oh, you're gonna click save. And now we still have to rehash and resign. So now we're going to go to Mario. You're going to drag and drop it back into Mario. And if you're having problems with that, you can um, uh, you can just open it up in here. And then you're going to go to right here. You're going to click Rehash and Resign. I hit it twice just to make sure. And then you're going to close this out. You're going to take it back over here. You're going to drag it and drop it right back in. It's going to say, do you want to overwrite this file? You're going to hit Yes. And then that should only take a second. And now you can close this out. And now we're going to go back to the Xbox. All right, so now that we're back on the Xbox, we're just going to go to memory again. But this time we're going to go to your USB. You're going to go to games. You're going to click on the game. You're going to hit move. And you're going to move it back to your hard drive. Now you've done all the hard stuff, now all you gotta do is go back into the game and then click load and then load whatever that save was called that you just modded and then you can enjoy. Thanks for watching and sorry about my phone and stuff going off and a little slow on the modding part but thanks for watching, please thumbs up and subscribe.